Good morning, LEGO fans. So today, as promised yesterday, I'm going to do a quick recording, mm, quickish recording, about the sets coming out October 1st. So, uh, as talked about in the previous video, uh, LEGO does have this Rebuild the World uh, theme going on, and they have for a while, but I believe that's going to be why they're mid-month October. They're probably having some event for Rebuild the World, uh, but let's talk about October releases. There is a lot, so I'm going to go through these uh, relatively quickly. Uh, this, my name is uh, Brickwise for this channel. If you don't already know, please make sure to subscribe to the channel and like the video if you like these. There's a lot coming out in October. So first off, we have the Spider-Man at the Sanctum Workshop. And this is a really neat set that comes with, uh, looks like uh, Doctor Strange, Spider-Man in, in a relatively neat uh, printing, and a couple other people that I don't know. I think that might be the Shang-Chi dude, and I don't know who the lady is. Um, but, you know what, we could easily find out, I'm sure. Real quick here. So, featuring Spider-Man, MJ, makes sense, Wong, and Doctor Strange. Oh, that's Wong, not Shang-Chi. Uh, and with a fabric cloak on Doctor Strange. So that's going to be $39.99. All of these come out October 1st, so I'm not going to say that uh, unless there's any specific exceptions. Uh, next, we have the stunt bike. There's a lot of these stunt bike sets coming out October 1st. These um, these these are pullback type of uh, sets here, and this is this is pretty neat. It comes with a, in uh, one one of the regular um, motocross helmets. I'm, I'm gonna say so. That's pretty neat. And the spider dude uh, over here, the mechanical spider, and then of course jumps. So with this, again, these bikes are pullback bikes. So this set, this course, this stunt park is $39.99. There's a lot of single bikes as well, but there's a whole lot of these uh, you know, stunt park type of things. Uh, so this is gonna be all kind of mixed up in, in what we have. Uh, there's no particular order that we're going through in this, but uh, this one, you've already seen a video from me before, Santa's Sleigh. This one comes out uh, at $36.99. As I've talked about before, it's really neat that it comes with four reindeer, a bunch of little tchotchke items in his sleigh, guitar, uh, skis, the uh, naughty nice list the little bear there it's a lot of really neat stuff uh, that comes with this set and of course you know i am getting this set all right so um, next up we have the stunt competition set so this one comes with a couple of stunt bikes uh, again, all of these are the pullback bikes. It comes with a fire ring, uh, which is really neat, I think. And uh, it looks like each one of these has uh, a hair as well as a helmet. So $29.99. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get into these. I'll probably reserve a uh, reservation for those. I do have a, a four-year-old who's turning five in January. Uh, he has not uh, talked about those yet. Now, this one here just says coming soon, but I believe at some point it said October 1st. Uh, this is basically a fanny pack, and uh, it, it's called a hip pack, uh, $25. Uh, again, um, I just figured I'd throw this out here. It's on their website. It's, it's coming soon. Uh, but if you're if you're in the, the the market for one, why not make it a, a Lego brick looking one? And then we have one of the Eternals sets here, uh, Lego Marvel Deviant Ambush, twenty four ninety nine. So you're gonna see a a bunch of these Eternals sets coming out as well. It comes with three minifigures. Uh, moving on, we have another Spider Man set. Uh, this one comes with uh, Spider-Man, a little bit different printing than previous ones, uh, Mysterio, and um, why is uh, his name escaping me? 1999, 
and Nick Fury. That's his name. Okay, this is uh, this is really cool though because it's a four plus set. Uh, so this is one we will probably be picking up ourselves. Uh, this is from the new movie coming out, which is interesting. Uh, I'm not going to talk specifically about it, but I wonder if that means Mr. Jake Gyllenhaal is going to be in that movie, if that's a, a bit of a spoiler or not. Um, but either way, a four plus set, those are always neat, uh, especially with having a four-year-old and not too not too badly priced in 1999. Uh, moving on, another Spider-Man set here. Now this one is not a four plus set. This one is also 1999. Uh, this set here comes with uh, a Spider-Man and a Vulture, and really, uh, really neat. Even though this is not a four plus set, this may be one that we end up picking up as well. Uh, the the wing setup right here is pretty awesome. That printing on Spider-Man, it's definitely new, definitely unique. Uh, so that is uh, certainly a, a set that we'll be considering here. This is also from that and from that new movie. So again, uh, you, you wonder, does that mean is this a bit of a spoiler? We haven't seen Vulture. Uh, or Mysterio in the trailers for this yet. It's coming out pretty soon, but uh, unless I've missed something, that is uh, interesting. I mean, I know the premise of the, the movies, but um, or the movie, rather, but still, maybe a spoiler that has happened before. Uh, now, here's another Christmas set, the Christmas Penguin. I will 100% be getting this set. Uh, this is $14.99. This will be ordered on October 1st very cute set here uh, these ones always have a little uh, easter egg in them i haven't looked at what that is but inside this little area right here there is going to be a little picture that's covered by these white plates right there and moving into this is another eternals set the aerial assault this comes with, uh, this is basically a mech set. It comes with two minifigures, though. One of them a child and uh, with the, the shorter legs. And this one is $9.99. So it's a pretty on-par price for the mech suits. Now, this obviously does not have uh, anybody inside there. I haven't seen much on the movie Eternals, uh, so I'm not 100% sure exactly what that, that uh, guy is. Uh, polar bear gift pack. So this is going to be the other Chris, uh, one of the other Christmas sets. So it comes with two ornaments, one polar bear, and one present. This is nine ninety nine, one hundred percent. Something I will also be getting on October first. Then the chicken stunt bike. So there's a number of these. These are all seven ninety nine for the single bike sets. Uh, this is the one that I will be getting. I love the minifigure and the uh, the color of the bike as well as the you know the decal right there. Uh, this is the one that I will be getting. Reserve my reservations for whether or not, not these are uh, neat or worth getting, uh, as they are the pullbacks. I don't. I haven't seen the pullbacks with Lego before. Uh, demolition stunt bike. So again, this one's going to be seven ninety nine, and. Uh, each one of them, each one of these guys has, uh, for the seven ninety nine ones, has uh, a neat little uh, decal on that, as well as a fairly unique set here. Uh, these aren't priced much higher than you know a, a random minifigure pack either, and you know what you're getting, so something to consider uh, for seven ninety nine might be worth it. So stunt bike is uh, the lady here. She's got, again, $7.99. All right, and then uh, she's got the, the flame here. And then, again, $7.99, all the, all the standard ones. Rocket stunt bike uh, is the next one here. Again, this one's going to be $7.99. And this one doesn't have something here, but it does, of course, down here, you can see. Uh, so a little bit different style of uh, of bike on that one, but still seven ninety nine. All right, and then uh, this one right here, the selfie stunt bike. 
maybe like a movie star type of thing. Uh, this one, again, has the decal down at the bottom, number one, and then dice on the front here. All right, and then, see a long list. You can see them at the bottom there. Uh, a wheelie stunt bike, again, $7.99. Uh, so there's a whole bunch of these single packs uh, like this. I'm glad they did them where you can actually pick versus uh, the video style ones where they're blind boxes uh, because there is a number of really neat uh, bikes, a number of really neat minifigures, the helmets. I mean, it's all pretty nice. Again, I'm just getting chicken soup myself, but I could see adding some of those to my collection. Uh, just a quick reminder as this one loads up here, don't forget to subscribe to BrickWise for unboxings, reviews, uh, news, things of that nature. And then the mini castle is coming out. Now I do have uh, personally the, the big castle. Uh, this is pretty neat. This is $34.99. It is uh, a, 12 plus, a 12 plus set, uh, but it is uh, kind of a neat item. It comes with the um, the the Mickey minifigure and it looks like a pretty pretty well done approximation of uh, making it a micro castle so pretty neat I, I believe I'll be getting this one but not on day one then we have a relatively expensive large set here the cat bulldozer this one is remote controlled the or app controlled rather d11 bulldozer 449.99 dollars 99 this thing is quite large though i want to show you this here 22.4 inches long uh, and then 10.2 inches tall uh, this thing is a beast uh, i will not personally be getting this but it would go very well with the uh, huge excavator if you had gotten that one all right, now we're going to look at the Super Mario 64 question mark block, uh, $179.99 for this one here. I, ha I did a feature, a video feature on this one as well when it was officially announced. I will be getting this one on day one, so watch out for an unboxing and a uh, review video on that one shortly after the unboxing. Uh, let's take a look at the pickup truck. Now this one, a long time ago, if you have been watching my videos, you will have seen that I did a video on this. I did a pre-order on it. They've actually sent it as of yesterday, so I should have that one soon. This one I should be able to do an unboxing and a review video uh, pretty back, pretty much back to back as soon as it arrives. This one is $129.99 if you haven't picked it up yet. Uh, that is a neat one if you are into the seasonal sets because this one you can edit and update for multiple seasons then uh, the ford f-150 raptor comes out as well this one is 99.99 uh, if you like ford if you like pickups uh, this might be a neat one this up here is the steering item for it it's not going to be powered but you can steer it back and forth i'll need to do a review video on the the jeep wrangler that we have so you can see that in action then we're going to talk about the Fender Stratocaster. So I did talk a little bit about this in the video from yesterday. As I mentioned, you have two of these uh, bases, and you can just take out you can just take out the um, uh, the neck and then put it back and forth between the two. And this is pretty neat. Uh, this seems to be a fabric uh, thing of some sort. And then it, if you've got the if you've got the uh, NES, these look to be the same material as the cord for the controller. So some neat, some neat updates on that. Oh, I never talked about the uh, the price on here. So the price for the Stratocaster ninety nine ninety nine. Uh, then the Queer Eye, the Fab Five Loft. This one here. Uh, if you are into that show, it is a neat one to get. Uh, there is a bunch of minifigures with this. Of course, the five plus the, the puppy, the bull, bulldog puppy. Uh, anyway, this one's $99.99. Uh, I never really watched the show myself, so not going to be getting that one. But uh, if you in, were, were into that, as I know a lot of people were, then that's a, probably a very good pickup. Um, 
more of the stunt ones. These are, uh, again, going to be pullbacks, but uh, with monster trucks. And you also get not only two monster trucks, you also get one of the uh, motorcycles and two of these cars here. And then this one is $99.99, so this is a stunt show arena. It also comes with a lot of minifigures. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, including one of them being a child minifigure. Uh, so if these are cool, if these are nice, if these are worthwhile, that would be a good one. Uh, Lego Marvel Rise of the Domo. So this is another Eternal set. And this one comes with six minifigures, and then the spaceship thing, and then uh, these two monster-built things. This one's $89.99. Uh, a lot goes into this set. I haven't been talking about pieces, but this is 1,040 pieces for that price. That's a, a good piece count. And then another stunt show. This is just a truck. Uh, and then, but it's a, like a semi-truck. You also get, though, one of the motorcycles, which is pretty neat uh, to have that, plus four minifigures. These, I'm going to say, maybe like they're new... Um, so $69.99 on that. Uh, these may be similar to their their new, I forget what it's called, but this, the scary ones, uh, Hidden Side. Uh, the Hidden Side, where the minifigures are just all, out, all over the place. Uh, classic TV series, Batman Cowl. So this is from the old show, the original TV show. Uh, $59.99. I think this is a pretty normal price for those uh, those stands. Uh, then another Eternals set. Again, kind of looks like a giant mech, uh, but I don't think you're going to go into these uh, at all. Uh, the the uh, minifigures don't fit in them at all. This one's $59.99. And then just two more here. Uh, the Batman Batmobile Tumbler with Scarecrow. Yeah, so this one comes with Scarecrow, Batman... Uh, Batman has a couple different faces uh, here, unless that's a scarecrow face. That kind of looks like it might be a scarecrow face. Uh, anyway, this one looks to be from the Christopher Nolan Batman movies. I know they're making a few different uh, of these Batman cars. Uh, and then here is the very last one, Sanctuary to Endgame Battle. This one has a tiny Thanos, uh, an Iron Man and who is that let's take a peek uh, anyway this one's 39.99 and that is uh, uh, i it's in here somewhere i'm sure um but i'm not seeing who that last one is so I'm Captain Marvel with fiery power blast and a shield. Okay, so that's Captain Marvel. Oh, I guess I could have zoomed in a little bit and found that out. So that's Captain Marvel. Okay. So with that being said, that is all uh, 50,000 releases that are happening October 1st. So I want to thank you for joining. I want to remind you all to subscribe to Brickwise, like the video, and... Uh, comment if you are picking up any of these yourself on October 1st or if you're planning on uh, getting any of these at any other time instead. Thank you very much and have a wonderful rest of your day. Goodbye.